My name is Anne Marie McDonnell, and I have a beautiful studio at Snug Harbor Cultural Center in Staten Island. I do a variety of artwork. I started as a painter. Um, for many years, I was a painter, and I was looking at the galleries and seeing what was exciting, and what was exciting to me was sculpture. So I became a sculptor. And I later chose printmaking as an option to accompany the sculpture. So printmaking is, continues as an important practice. And I've chosen to include two prints in this exhibition. So the first print is from 1999. And the reason I know it's from 99 is because they actually dated the print. I don't usually date my prints and many printmakers don't, but in this particular case, I did date it because there was a very specific reason. I had read an article about the Afghanistan women and what they were going through with the Taliban. And they were no longer able to go to the schools. They were no longer be able to walk in the streets without a burqa, completely covered. And they were being forced to not work. And I found this very shocking. I didn't know what to think, but uh, my reactions, the way I react, is through artwork. So I did this piece called For the Women of Afghanistan, and I used three women who were sitting in a tree's and they were putting together sheets as you would when you're escaping something. They were actively working to try to escape a situation that must have been untenable for women at that time. So, so that was the piece that I had put in that I immediately thought of would be perfect for this exhibition, Don't Shut Up. My new piece, the piece that I did once I knew that I was in the exhibition, updated this whole Afghanistan women and what was going on with women in Afghanistan. And I chose to highlight Mayor Ghaffani, who is a 26-year-old woman who was appointed by the uh, president of Afghanistan to be the mayor of a city. The city is 35,000 people, but it is in a very conservative part of Afghanistan, a part in which is very sympathetic to the Taliban. So how would one react to having a woman mayor? Well, the first day she found out was she was greeted by a mob of men and she had to escape for her life. But she was not going to give up. She went back and she basically said, no, this is, I might be killed. The expectation is that I will be killed, but no, women need to take a seat at the table, and that is what she has done. So the image itself is really from uh, a, a photograph that was in the New York Times highlighting her. It took place at a meeting in City Hall, and there were men in it, but I chose to focus on Mayor Ghaffani and the, only the hands of the men. The men are not shown in my print, but it's so symbolic for the fact that women have a seat at the table and they are fighting for their right to be there and to influence their community. Mayor Ghaffani had come to the United States in March to receive the 2020 International Woman of Courage Award at the White House. And she took that opportunity to plead with the administration to make sure that women did not lose their rights now that there will be peace in, through this negotiation that includes the Taliban. So they are fearful of losing their rights, but they again will, will be fighting for their rights to remain persons at the table.